Hi, I'm back with a new version uh, and this time it's more compact than before and ready to be embedded. First, what is an 80 tiny? Well, it's a small 8 pin high performance low power AVR risk based con controller with 8 kilobytes of program storage, uh, 512 bytes of memory, um, 512 bytes of EEPROM data. Um, it's capable of CPU speeds up to 60 MHz with an internal os uh, oscillator um, and 20 MHz uh, with an external oscillator. It has six GPIO pins that can be used as interrupts, uh, analog to digital converter, PWM signals and other cool stuff. Oh, and I forget, it's very affordable, almost $2 uh, and it's very easy to, to use and program. The simplest way to program an IT Tiny is by using an Arduino Uno. Uh, I won't cover how to program an IT Tiny because there are a lot of good tutorials on how to do just that, but I will leave a link to a simple and well-explained tutorial in the description. I've also changed the step-down converter to a more smaller and efficient one uh, that uses MP1584EN um, chip capable of delivering up to 3 amps, uh, has a maximum input um, of 28 volts, uh, and now we, uh, with all the lights off, the whole project draws about 20 milliamps. So for the first sketch we have signal light, daylight with signal light. We can also dim the daylight and night rider lights. Now it's time for a cool tip. Get yourself some thick plexiglass, resistant to high temperatures, clear or matte, whatever you find, uh, cut it to your desired dimensions uh, for straight or corner use, like this one, bend it with hot air gun um, to your desired shape and sand it well with some fine sanding paper like this after that take a piece of paper uh, draw a line representing your result uh, your resulted plexiglass shape uh, start laying out the leads um, that will go behind the plexiglass don't forget to respect the signal direction and solder them well after that find a way to fix the leads uh, to the plexiglass, but remember that in the future you may need to change the LEDs. Um, that actually depends on the quality of your LEDs. Uh, so if you glue them uh, to the plexiglass, make sure that you get good quality LEDs. Otherwise you will have to remake uh, the, plexigla the plexiglass shape. And after that, you, sh you should have something like this. Oh, by the way, uh, I didn't have too much time to finish it well. Let's hook it up and see and see it in action. So here it is. Signal light. Daylight. It's signal lights. And night rider lights. And now let's write the second sketch uh, and see the backlights. Okay, and for the second sketch we have brake light, reverse light, fog lights, and tail lights with a simple effect.
in the first take uh, I forgot to mention um, that this entire project is powered from 14.6 volts and the simplest way to control the input is by using an optocoupler this is the 5 volt side of the optocoupler this is the 14 volt side and we can control it with no problem As in the previous versions, uh, details and download link are in the description. Everything is customizable in the code, timings, colors, patterns, and also everything is commented, so it should be very easy. Hope you like this project, and if you did, please like, share, and subscribe, or even donate, because that will help me in making more projects like this. Thanks.